Hey guys, how are you doing? So I wanna give you a heads up again. Tomorrow, Wednesday, March 13th, and I, again, Empire Knife Club meeting. I'm definitely coming. I know there is one or two other guys coming. Our from you know our let's call it younger generation from knife users, knife collectors. So that's gonna be pretty cool. Definitely welcome, guys. It I had always great time, and uh, I think you know you're gonna like it. You know, just even even though it's not like a knife show. It's still likely-minded people. If you're lucky, you know there are some people will bring some cool knives and stuff, so you get to see something. If you're really lucky, Jim Cooper will come again with some really exquisite pieces, which would be really nice. I I keep I'm keeping my fingers crossed because he has a really gorgeous collection. And I want to give a little thank you, a big thank you. Uh, got the new flashlight from my friend Brian. Be done uh, over at Aftams last weekend. You know when I when we hang out when we had the barbecue. And he gave me as a birthday gift. He was another, you know, birthday celebrator. And he got me this little Olight baton. And this is the titanium, Polish titanium version. And I love this light. It really is a cool little light. It has a magnet. Only downside for me, it has a CR123 batteries, which I don't have any of. I just don't use it. I never bought the battery, the flashlight that used those batteries. But it really is nice. The magnet on the end. For my work, it's perfect. You know, I can stack it on anything in the ceiling when I'm working, when I'm running cables and stuff like that. So it's pretty, pretty neat. I like it a lot. And it's, look how small it is. And it's really bright. It has a really good features. You know, the, the low, the moonlight is really low. And actually, unlike a lot of other lights, it's super quick to get the strobe. So it kind of, it sh could be considered tactical flashlight because it really is quick to get to that mode. I really like it, really cool. Definitely gonna anodize it or try. If if I can take it apart to, the, to remove the electronic components and everything else, I'll definitely anodize it. I'll definitely try. And a little teaser. Did the new blade for uh, Mind's Mirror. He came up with a really cool idea for uh, Kirinite. He wanted this lava Kirinite and uh, Toxic Green liners. And you guys know that I do like the orange and Toxic Green combination. I do like colorful stuff and I do like natural woods and I think these really work out well together. So let me put it like this to give you a little more detail. It has nice mosaic pin. You see that one? Perfectly finished. This handle is pretty much spotless, like it's perfect. Not a single scratch. I really tried my best on this one. I'm getting it down to what I have to do to, you know, make it time of you know reasonably time wise and everything. And I only had one piece, so I did I did only the one one mosaic pin up front and then brass tube in the end. Came out nice. Still have to get the you know blend that that uh, bevel. It's really nice and thin, grind, convex, but I still have to fix up that bevel a little bit because it just doesn't look nice when you have such a you know, it looks like a big bevel, but it's just microscopic difference in the angle on the very edge and the main grind, so I just have to kinda of blend them in. But it is very thin, nice grind, and I think it just works well together. It's gonna probably get what I started with. I'll see how it looks brown, but I'll mix some black overspray maybe with some kind of pattern in it because I think it's gonna go together. And even, even Mind's Mirror said that it, it would probably go well with uh, some kind of brown shade. And it's gonna be over uh, fold over sheet with a nice thumb ram, you know, nice slim streamline for the pocket carry. So that's pretty cool. And uh, I have to edit a video today, which a lot of you guys will look forward to too, actually. I have to vi edit videos together for Gear Bash on Giveaway, which is pretty big deal. And I also have to do a video for my drawing, for my contest, as I promised for today, my birthday. So you guys have some really cool stuff to look for forward to, some big announcements, you know, the big winners. Some people will be really happy today or tomorrow. I don't know when I get to upload it, so but it's going to be soon. So guys, thanks for watching. Take care, stay safe. I hope to see you tomorrow. And remember, don't cut yourself.